Hello ladies and gentlemen, Silver to Burn here. I'm going to show you today how to sand cast a mold to make a silver nickel. Using Petrobon sand. working kind of fast here. So this is a plastic piece here that I just showed you. It's a little bit rounded. That's not going to be easy to pour. I wish it was metal. This is the one that I poured earlier. It didn't pour up all the way. Still turned out pretty good. Thirty seven grams. Since this is rounded a little bit, I'm going to put a little sand in the bottom of the mold <coughs> using a two piece mold. It looks like this. You want to start with the one without the pegs. I'm going to put a little sand in the bottom first. Only because this is a little little rounded. I want it to sit on something. Put a little, little parting dust. Now you go ahead and pack the rest of the sand on there. I like to pack it now to get to get a nice crisp design. I need to scrape it off. I like to use this saw. It has teeth on it. Makes it really nice for the first couple scrapes. You don't press down very hard. I'm going to flip it over and use the smooth side. Underneath that is where that nickel is. You want to dig it out. Try to keep my hands out of the way this time. You want to take and cut the sand down all the way around it down to half the way of your object.
just like that you carve it halfway down your design Trying to keep my hand out of the way. You have a little brush like this, it helps to get all the little pieces out of there. Now you need to carve a trench up front here. to take enough away so that it will come out. You just try it to make sure it will come out. You don't take it out yet. Just want to clean it up real nice right where it's going to pour in make sure that there's going to be enough room for it to get in there now you want to put the second half on but you want to put some parting dust on there so that the tools will come apart later. Blow off the dust, clean up all the sand around the rim. And put this one on. Pack it full of sand. You're going to want to wrap some wire around it before you cast it. Just to hold it nice and tight together. Pack it down real well. Make sure there's no sand in between the molds. I like to fill at least halfway full. Pack it, pack it down to get the detail out of the coin. Pack it down real well, scrape it off. Open it up. Make a little couple little spots for the air to, to escape as you pour the silver in. That's what I forgot to do on this nickel. That's why it didn't fill up all the way. Pack 
it down real good. Just scrape it off. These are easy to open compared to those round rings. Just take and stick a little knife in there. And lift it up, straight up. Most of the time, this will stay there. And it came off, it's okay. little pieces you just pack them down. You want to check right in right in here make sure that so you're right got just a little bit more out of there. That's all you have to do for this one. This one here you have to scrape that piece off of there. Make a trench in here. There you go, you want to make sure silver we're pouring right there. Now you want to loosen it a little bit and try to get it out of there. It looks like it will come right off. Came out, had a little resistance back in here. Up a little piece of it. Oh, a little bit of the lettering is here is messed up. Not the best, but it is what it is. You can see his face there. <laughs> 